Hello my lovelies and welcome back to Allotment of the Dead. So today's instalment is going to be a bit of a collaboration. Um, I think lots of you know that I've grown a lot of chilies this year, uh, many of which are super hot. So there was probably, there was about 75 different varieties of super hot chilies that I tried growing. Not all of them have actually come to fruition. Um, but there are a lot growing at the moment, which are just starting to um, give me some really decent, ripe, juicy pods. Um, and there's a variety of different shapes and colours and all that sort of thing in that lot. Um, and probably the hottest variety that I've got currently, because my reapers aren't really showing themselves much at the moment. They're tiny little plants, and I'm not sure I'll even get any this year. But um, I'm giving them a fighting chance. But the hottest ones I've got is this variety here called Dragon's Breath. So this is a variety that was produced by Red Dragon Seeds um, in, in the middle of Wales, or maybe not in the middle of Wales. I need to probably find out whereabouts in Wales. But um, it's a UK-grown variety of super hot chilli that is supposed to rival the reaper so when i said that this is going to be a bit of a collaboration i've tasked a few of my work colleagues and friends in the local area to try this as well so i've, all, I've given them all a um, pod from the dragon's breath chili and we're all going to try it and i'm going to post hopefully post all of the um videos to this one video I'll probably start with them first and then I'll put this particular video at the end uh, as to how I kind of coped with the heat or maybe not. So this is supposed to rival the, um, the Reapers, so over 2 million Scovilles. So uh, we shall try and give this a go. Right, I'll uh, let you see how the others cope first and then will come back to me doing this taste sensation. If I can handle this and I can handle any of the others that I'm growing this year. See you in a bit. Hi, uh, again, we've got uh, the last uh, or the second segment of our chili taste test uh, challenge. Again, thank you so much uh, from Thank you so much to Jason from Allotment of the Dead. So please like and uh, subscribe to his uh, YouTube channel. So what we've got now is the Dragon's Breath. And uh, from what I've uh, seen online and also on some uh, clips on YouTube, it's uh, a real killer. I don't know if it's literally or what, but Anyway, so here goes. Hi, I'm Roy, and welcome to Jackass. Smell-wise, it's got a faint uh, smell of uh, fruitiness, but so far, okay. So here goes, let's do the first bite. fruity but you can feel that uh, the heat is really sinking in and it's really intense okay second bite
you can feel it uh, on my palate, the top of my mouth, and uh, also around my lips. But uh, <laughs> still okay. <laughs> right, next one. The heat is uh, quite intense, and I can and my tongue is just uh, uh, wrapped up in this uh, really really intense heat. Uh, okay. To the stem. Yeah, I can I can really feel the heat around my mouth, inside my mouth, on my lips, and uh, in my throat. <clears throat> I can feel the sweat coming out of my scalp. The fruitiness, the the smell, and the scent of that uh, chili is uh, really fruity. But the heat, you can you can really tell that uh, the taste is really building up. Wait. Hmm. Even on my gums, even on my gums, inside my gums, it's, uh, you know, my nose is starting to get runny. It's still there, but uh, it's just maintaining a uh, what do you call this? A steady, steady intense heat. I'm just surprised that I can still tolerate it without drinking any water or any milk. But anyway, that's it. I can say that. Uh, I I can tolerate just one, just one of these uh, dragon's breath chili. But if I am going to be offered another one, I don't think I can make it. But it is a really really nice uh, chili to be mixed with uh, really really spicy cooking. So anyway, again, thank you for watching and. Uh, all the best, goodbye, take care. Okay, dragon's breath. Eat it whole. 2.2, maybe more million Scovilles. Oh.
there's a builder definitely building starts strong but okay and um he looks a lot to cry well it, it might be good for daddy daddy's mm -hmm. feeling a bit fluey at the moment and this is going to liven up the uh, taste buds maybe wake the system up <sighs> but actually not as prolonged as I thought it would be I can I can still think mm. Mm. thank you Jason I think I got got away with that one everyone so today i've been given a dare to try one of the highest chilies from jason's plot let's see how i get on <coughs> oh my god it's so hot <coughs> oh my god, my mouth is on fire. <laughs> Really, really spicy. My mouth is on fire. I feel. I can feel it. My nose is running. Oh my god. <laughs> I'm struggling. I. Like... Oh my god. <coughs> Never again am I trying something like this again. Never. Hi. So we are going to try this chili. Uh, it's a dare, so me and my husband are going to try this. This is a chili from uh, Jason's plot. And yeah, we're going to try this. So here we go. How is it? Mm. Is it okay, yeah? I feel like kind of sweet. Place. Yeah, it tastes like start with that. I actually ate the whole thing. I think it's getting spicier. It is. <coughs> I think it's burning. My tongue is burning. I'm gonna hold it and like all is well, all is well, all is well. Ah. <laughs> ah. My God, so spicy. So spicy. Oh. Come back. Oh. Ah. Ah. <laughs> Thank you very much for the spicy ah. dessert. I don't think I can even eat my one some little bit. Ah. Ah. Ah! <sighs> 
Thank you, bye. Thank you, bye. All right. Dragon's breath. Let's give this a go, yeah? I got my milk ready. <laughs> I'm so scared, man. I, I'm so scared. I'm only going to take like this much, okay? Why are you laughing at me? It's just funny. Okay, okay. Mm. It smells so good though. <laughs> oh shit. It's alright so far. I can smell the spice from here actually. You don't seem like you're reacting too badly to it actually. It's been 10 seconds. I can put the chilli down now, I don't think you need any more. Oh, oh, it smells so good though. Don't put your hands near your face though. Oh. Now move your thumbs from your eyes, you can get in your eyes. My thingy, my spit's so hot. <coughs> Hello, look, your dad's going crazy. I'm going to see how long I can go without milk. So far, it's been one minute and 20 seconds. You're doing well. You've got my heart's burning. Do the breathing exercise, the total labour. Yeah, hold your. Oh, actually, I guess your breath's quite spicy, isn't it? Oh, just. Oh. Dude, my spit is like, my spit's burning. Okay, you've reached two whole minutes. Good job. Alexa, turn off TV. Oh. <laughs> Did you take a sip of milk? Not yet. Oh, my face is tingly. Don't touch your face because you touched the chilli. <laughs> I mean, it's getting worse. You don't touch me with your chilli hands. Okay. Hold on. That's burning. She's <laughs> looking at you like a complete idiot. Do you want to see her look of judgment? She's judging you hard. I don't want to have this eat. No, 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 put it down. Put it down. Such a pussy. Dude. Stop touching your face, your skin's going to burn. Everything's tingling. Put your hands down. My jaws are tingling. Hands down. It's like a, it's like a, it's like a, like a, literally like a, I don't even know how to, my mouth is burning, the middle of this bloody is drinking, it's it's, it feels swollen. Am I bleeding? No. <laughs> like my mouth is bleeding. Every mouth? No. I wouldn't show the camera your tongue. I feel like my mouth is bleeding like that. <sighs> it's only been four minutes and 20 seconds.
think she approved. I know that. I know. It burns. Trust me. But I'm not doing this ever again. I swear. Oh, my eyes are like my eyes are popping. I feel like my head's popping. <laughs> Take your coffee's out of the question then. Let me go. I'll go get it for you. Just for you. <sighs> 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 oh, even that's pretty. You just gonna say. Oh. oh, I can't breathe. I swear it's like. Oh, it's proper numbing, like my camera feet. You want to try it? No, thanks. Give it a go. Nope. Oh, my nose is right here. I'm not doing it again. I am not doing that again. Oh, no, no, It's been what nine minutes? Oh, no. I don't know how long it's been. You know, the back of the throat is like gone. I can't feel my throat. That's okay. Am I bleeding? No. I'm not joking. <laughs> I think I'm bleeding. You want to give it a go? No, thanks. It's like four glasses in. Even I feel like crying right now, like this. Okay. Okay, four. Okay, it's starting to die down a bit. Back of the throat is gone. I'm shaking now, I'm not doing this again. Wanna try it? No. Why have you been a whip? Give it a go. I have brain cells. <sighs> Okay, so uh, let's give this a go. Straight away, there's that fruitiness in this. The smell is what you'd expect from a really, really hot chili. The um, flavor is it's actually really nice. Oh crikey! I'm getting, I'm getting the cups come straight down my throat now, and it's oh, the actual heat has gone completely around my mouth. It's like a ring of fire. Oh, I have swallowed it. Ah. Oh, sticking my tongue out might have been a mistake. It's actually genuine pain now. Oh, I can't. Oh. Uh, back of my throat is burning now. Oh, I can't handle this. Oh. Uh. Oh,
Oh. I'm still getting the flavour. It's still there, the Caribbean kind of fruitiness of the chilli. Just to let you know, I've had probably a pint and a half of milk already. I feel like my mouth is blistered. <sighs> my lips are actually burning still. Um, eyes are watering. <sighs> it's actually repeating on me. <sighs> I've actually had two teaspoons of sugar as well in the hope that that will hit different taste buds to try and take some of the pain away. It doesn't seem to be working. Oh. This is the hottest chili I've ever tasted, ever. Oh, I can't lick my lips. It's just, it's almost like spreading it in, in new areas. My tears feel hot. I think the, the one kind of major mistake that I made was it stayed at the back of my throat for probably too long. So I think I've probably hit my uvula and the uh, epiglottis where, oh, oh. I do not get how Chase the Heat does this. Crazy. Okay. <coughs> <clears throat> that heat is starting to dissipate a little bit. Oh. Okay. <sighs> Literally, I had to go into the kitchen to steady myself to try and get over that initial panic. Everything that caps has come does is a deterrent from things eating it except birds birds are immune to capsicum so they will basically eat chilies dispersed seeds that sort of thing mammals aren't so good it can kill cats so i've kept it well away from him but i think even the smell probably be coming from me now it's probably too hot. Oh. <sighs> A nice glass from Bodmin Jail. This would be a proper deterrent, I think, for uh, rehabilitation. Uh, it's definitely made me not want to try another one of these. Ah. Oh. I will get back to you in about 15 minutes or so. So it's about quarter past seven now. I'll try and get back to you about half past seven and let you know where there's been any change. That flavour, though, is fantastic. As much as I can taste of it. I am keeping it down, but it's... 
but it's pain like you would not believe. Oh, red dragon seeds. This is one hell of a chili. Fantastic. Yeah, I'll get back to you in 15 minutes. So, they always say cats frolic around you when they uh, suspect someone's not feeling too great. So, 15 minutes gone by. Um, heat is still around the mouth, and I've still got a burnt tongue. <clears throat> okay, so I did the 15 minute later thing. Didn't keep you on the screen for very long. Um, my mouth was still quite hot by then, still burning a little bit. Um, up to three hours later, I could still have a little bit of heat there and still taste that real flavor that we had from that chili coming through. So it's a long lasting experience. Um, I think my wife asked me why I do these sort of things. And I said, it's because it's something different, something new, something you don't do too often. And it's potentially something that shouldn't kill you, but you will get some sort of, I don't know, endorphin release from it. There was a little bit of panic at one point with, with me. Um, and I think if you've hopefully seen the rest of the videos that I've actually attached to this, um, you'll see there's probably that certain amount, a little bit of panic in uh, some of those videos uh, from my friends and work colleagues as well. So, yeah, it's been an interesting night. So uh, I'm not going to say don't try this at home. I will say, give it a go. <laughs> Anything that doesn't kill you makes you stronger. At least that's what they say. So uh, we'll call it a day for tonight. We'll call it a night for tonight. And uh, we'll see you on the next video. Hopefully, trying a few other chilies. I think anything from this point on is not going to be that hot. That's the hottest chili I've ever tasted. Um, again, it's not something that... Um, you come across too often either so uh, thanks red dragon seeds for the uh, seeds um, i will be buying some more seeds this year fantastic company go and take a look and uh, yeah we'll see you on the next video so uh, all the best guys take care bye bye